Greetings, brothers, sisters, friends, and foes. It's Bill from Agape on the streets. And uh, wow, I've really been uh, going through some stuff. Um, just the pain of what I'm going through with my heels and my legs and, and my back and different things going on. It's It's been pretty intense at times, but God continues to get me through it. He continues to provide. Um, been having some meetings here at work, uh, kind of strange. They're really just, it's like they're just going to go, go, yeah, yeah, just keep going. But coming to a point now where it's it's going to be hard line, just no, I can't go like this anymore. So uh, I'm just praying. I don't know what that's going to look like. But uh, in the meantime, God continues to use me. I'm, I'm helping out a young uh, person who's uh, gone through quite a bit living in a little minivan on the streets, uh, mid-20s, uh, by the name of Aaron. He's got a dog and a cat. Dog has cancer, has to put it down. Uh, poor kid was um, literally just sold by mom to some sex guy, some pedophile guy at a very early age and managed to escape and has been just kind of running and is here on the streets. So, uh, I gave the kid a safe place to stay. It's been transgendering, and we're discussing that. Um, a lot going on with this young one. So uh, keep Aaron in prayer. And uh, in the meantime, I'm just showing Aaron the love of Jesus and uh, discussing why Jesus came for us uh, to save us uh, from these kinds of things, literally, all the bad decisions and stuff we make. Uh, I love y'all. Uh, I could really use some support right now. Please get a hold of me. Go to our website, agapeonthestreets.com. There's a link to Telegram on there. It's the best place to go. If you got my phone number, you can text me, get a hold of me. I'd like to talk to some of you. you. Uh, don't exactly know what everything's going to look like right now, but I am to a point where I'm being forced for some major changes. I got everything I own is out of court side. It's all here. It's all sitting right here in Flagstaff. Um, don't know if God's moving me far from here. Don't know what's going on yet, but I know there's major change that uh, it, it has to happen at this point. Because even if I were to get the operation to fix the things that I have going on right now, I'd have a six-month recovery period. So uh, either way around it, this job isn't going to continue. Hey, Love every single one of you. God bless you all. Bye-bye now.